And number four, Dead Silence. I remember my first time watching this movie, and wow, it was terrifying. There's just something about puppets that creeps me out, and I know I'm not alone in that thought. This movie brings out the word creepy in its realest sense. Puppets plotting to destroy and conquer is something that no one wants to deal with. However, if you're looking for a good scare and the hair on your neck to stand, Dead Silence should do the trick for you. Number four on my list is Doctor Sleep. Now, I grew up loving The Shining. The movie is by far one of the best horror movies I've ever seen in my life. Stanley Cooper got his finest. However, Doctor Sleep, continuing on that story 30 years later, Ewan McGregor's in it. He stars as an older Danny Torrance. Just one of the greatest performances I've ever seen. Honestly, a movie that just like Saw went under the radar. Not a lot of people talk about it, and I feel like for what it is, it deserves a lot more hype and acclaim. Doctor Sleep, as I've said, takes place 30 years after The Shining. It's about Danny Torrance. He's a little older. He's a little wiser. And The Shining is this power that he now knows is real. You know, he lived through it in the original movie, but now he knows that this power is real and he has to live with this for the rest of his life. He befriends this little girl who also can shine. And that's where the story unfolds from there. Dr. Sleep is by far just one of the most creative horror movies I've seen in a long time. It definitely gave me a lot of obviously the Shining vibes, but also Annabelle creation vibes in a weird way. Definitely a movie that went under the radar for a lot of people. It came out in November of last year, so it's about to have his one year birthday pretty soon. But if you haven't checked out Dr. Sleep, by all means, it's free on HBO Max. I would highly, highly suggest watching it. It is going to be an experience that you will not forget. It's some of the coolest stuff I've ever seen on screen. 